guys and welcome back to my channel. As promised, I'm going to be sharing with you everything that is in everyone's stocking this year. I fill the stockings at our leak house because more often than not, Santa does not show up there, which I totally get. I mean, he has a lot of places to go on Christmas Eve, so I don't anticipate that he will go to our house and our vacation house. So I take the liberty of helping him out just in case he can't make it. So I'm going to show you everything that is in my son's stocking, and this would be appropriate for a boy probably anywhere from the age of maybe 11, 12 to, I don't even know, well into the teen years, 16, 17. A lot of these items are also in my husband's stocking too, so I think they're relevant for most older boys and men too. So let me go ahead and show you everything that I have here in his stocking. This is something that I pretty much get him every year and we need to get it every year because somehow it is lost or broken by the end of the year. And that's just a very basic umbrella. This is a black totes umbrella. This one actually feels pretty sturdy, so I'm hoping it'll hold up for a little while. But my son always seems to need an umbrella. He walks to school every day and if the weather is bad, oftentimes we drive him to school, but in the event that we don't, he can just bring this umbrella. Something else that I thought was fun, which is also going to be in my husband's stocking, is this wooden back scratcher, just very basic wooden. I think it was only a dollar, maybe one or two dollars from Walmart, but it's perfect for fitting into a stocking. It's like the perfect size and it's kind of like such a novelty thing, but I just think it's fun anyway. And I do think that he will like that. Also something that we can never have enough of for the boys. <laughs> Our socks so I got him these socks I, th I think everything here is from Walmart if not Target um, so just to let you know I usually shop at Walmart and Target for all of my stocking stuffer items and these are just no-show socks in the high performance with odor eliminating technology so that's a good thing to have right I also have this comb and brush combo. The girls all have their wet brushes and all these, you know, fun brushes and things, but it's one thing I don't often think to get for my son. So I thought this was something great for him to have. Something else that he uses every day is this Axe like hair gel, and this is the signature clean cut look. And it just helps for him to style his hair, his hair in the morning as best as he can. He usually like just kind of pushes it back a little bit so it's not in his face and in his eyes. So this seems to be one of his favorites. So I picked up another one of these for him. Now that my son is getting older, when we go to events, he is wearing dress pants and a suit jacket and a button down shirt and he's really you know spiffing himself up and looking good and one thing that he no longer has he had at one point in time when he was little but we haven't bought one in a while and that is a new belt and I like this belt because I don't know if you guys have ever seen the reversible kind so it's brown or black you can flip it over and use either color which is great and I got the smallest one that I could find in the men's department because his waist is so ridiculously small and I'm hoping that he'll like this because I know the last time we went, went out and he wore dress pants he could not find a belt that fit and of course no stocking is complete without a whole bunch of treats that should be half the stocking so I have for him this beef summer sausage he seems to like beef jerky and Slim Jims and things like that and I liked this because it's like the perfect size to fit in the foot of the stocking and I definitely think that he'll eat it so that is one treat and then I also got these gummy bears he has always loved gummy bears so i knew i couldn't go wrong with this and some of the starbucks hot chocolate their hot chocolate is really rich and very very good and i think it's really cute the way they have it in this little hot chocolate pouch with a with a little hook on top i guess you could like hang it on the tree or you can hang it on the stocking stuff or a holder thing if the stocking is overflowing which most of the time it is so i just thought that would be something great for him to have and i think there's two servings in here yeah it makes two cups of hot chocolate and finally i always pick up one of these candy canes that are filled with chocolates and there's so many different chocolate varieties but this year i'm just getting basic hershey kisses because i don't know if you have ever done this but i like to throw a hershey kiss or two 
in my hot cocoa sometimes it just makes it extra good and my kids like to do that too so i figured since we're going to be here at our lake house over the holiday season everybody would really enjoy having hot chocolate and hershey kisses and they can do the combination of dropping a couple in their hot chocolate mug to make it extra rich and yummy so that is everything that i managed to somehow fit in this stocking for my son. I hope that you guys found these ideas helpful. Please let me know in the comments below what you include in your son's stocking or your husband's stocking. Sometimes I have a harder time shopping for the boys than I do for the girls because the girls with makeup and face masks and all of the things that girls like, it is so easy to go nuts with the girl stockings, but with the boys, I struggle just a little bit. So I would love to hear suggestions in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you're all off to a great holiday season and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.